I'm Heather and welcome back to my channel. So we are back today with Settlement Survival. Um, in the last episode, like pretty much nothing happened. We took in some people. We had some people die. That's basically it. So what I was thinking about in the last one was whether or not my path had been going down agriculture to farming efficiency. However, the technology points are so incredibly slow. Like, we're just barely above halfway here, I think. Not, maybe not even. And it, it's just going so, so slow. So I'm thinking about jumping over either to school expansion or paper mill. I'm not sure exactly which one would be better. This is an upgrade in this, and we do actually have then the necessary materials here to do the books where we don't to do like the boarding school or anything like that and then advanced research down here so we actually have everything currently to move along this path where we actually don't have everything to move along this path but i wonder if this would be better than this. I mean, we're going to make that decision. <laughs> and unfortunately, I'll have this one and the next several already recorded by the time it goes up, so I will not necessarily be able to get that advice. <sighs> um, I guess it doesn't matter. Let's see. Number of students that can accommodate plus five, so it would move it to 20 students. And so far, that seems like it would cover pretty much everyone we've got available that needs to go to school. And t school technology output plus 100%. So this is our research right here, so I guess it would just double it, essentially. Um, oh. Maybe what it is, is we are at 50%. Okay, I think I get it. So currently our research output is at 50%. So if we did the other one, it would move it to 100%. Okay. And our current output of research is 20. So it would do it to 40. Um... And this research, our current output is 30. Paper would make it more efficient, but we don't have paper. So maybe we do, unless it doubled that, we're probably better off doing the school. So I guess we'll do the school efficiency right now, then we'll do, uh, the farming efficiency, then we'll do the paper mill. Because it's not like we have anyone to work in the paper mill anyway. Because we're already lacking people. We've already had people die. Since we took in our last group of people. So, it's fine. We'll just do it like this. Um, when we first started, because of the fact that we had people come in... We did have, like, this kind of thing. I thought I added someone there. Apparently I didn't. I thought I did. Maybe they died, too. Uh, we meant to add someone there. I don't know. And I would like to eventually get enough money to order crops and stuff like that. Like, crops would be good, but they're very expensive. So even if, if we order them, if they come up on the merchant ship on their own, they're still quite expensive. I wonder if I should add another house, or like upgrade one of these houses. But I don't have the building kits, I don't think. Uh, and a farmer died of old age. All my old people seem to be farmers. 
Because I constantly have farmers die. I don't even know what... What field they were in. I guess it must have been this one, because I think this one was full. That is really annoying. <laughs> like, really annoying. Okay. A miner has died. Which miner? It was this guy. Doing silver. Of course it was. I think we probably still have enough silver for a little while to make some coins. But the silver didn't come very quickly. And I do think it's better to not move someone out of this mine. This mine is depleted, so we can't do anything with that one, but we can't get rid of it. Okay, so we'll, oh, I don't, what I don't need is two people probably on the salt thing. Okay, someone graduated from school so they can go down in the silver mine. But I have two people working this salt thing, and I really don't think that's necessary. So I'm going to have someone come work in the fuel factory. Okay. We've got that food coming in. And then where is everyone... Here, I have nine old people still. And there's our merchant ship coming in. So we'll see where that goes. This just, just needs to hurry up. I'm so annoyed at how slow it is. Okay, come on. Go ahead and dock so we can check it out. Okay. On the merchant ship, Turkey. We still have all this sitting in here. We do. I don't really feel like buying anything. We're fine, I think, on most things. What I do need is somebody to come in here. Oh, but I think what the reason we weren't doing that is because of these. I need a nursery to plant those. That's why we weren't taking those out. Okay. What I may do is add those into the cell items just so I don't use those. So cell items will do the 100 right here, the cocoa beans and the, I guess maybe I, those can't be in there, like these. Okay, well, we'll just leave that because they're, we're not hurting anything by leaving those in there. We need to get to the nursery to do that. And I don't think that's actually all that far off. But again, we need to get this done. The school, like the technology points need to get better. I guess we could do the nursery instead of farming efficiency, but it's like we have to do the grove first, then this. So it's a while out. Oh, a builder committed suicide. Thanks a lot, man. So we have one builder. What I do need to do is go ahead and redo this cemetery. It's not like the builder that I have is doing anything else. So they could come out here and do this because we already have people in this cemetery. So we're just, this has worked for us so far. We have two cemeteries. We tear one down when it gets full. And then rebuild it. So we're never without a cemetery. 
Okay. But except for herbs, we seem to be doing okay. Still have no idea why it's either red or green, because this is sometimes red, sometimes green. Don't know why. Don't know why at all. So, there's that. Um, yeah, I mean, it's mostly just waiting around for things. For people to die, or to be born, or for there to be technology points. Which is... Really, really slow. We still have like 10,000 technology points to go. Um, I wish someone would like age up, or, or something. It's been a while since we've seen immigrants. And I'm not actually sure what makes it just time, maybe, that makes them stop coming. I don't really know. I do kind of think maybe I need to build a new house. Do I have the stuff to upgrade this? Maybe. I guess let's do it. It should happen after this. Because I guess I need to try to aim for at least 20 students. Then if this is eventually going to max capacity when I get the upgrade. Oh, see, our research progress, progress is 66. Huh. I don't know. I thought I understood what this was, and I suppose it has to do with this. But I, then I guess... At most, with 15 students, it could only do, like, maybe 70%. So those extra five students are what gives it 100% over that. Gatherer! Why? I don't... I guess I have to take someone off the apiary. To put you in the gatherer's hut. Okay. I mean, the Gatherer's Hut doesn't do much, but it does at least get us a few of these things. Okay, what else? So we, it is time to harvest, and, or I guess to plant everything. Otherwise, we're just kind of waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting. Because no one is aging up. Let's check our children and see if anyone's close to aging up. Okay. So you're at 66, 95. So you're almost done. You're 91. That's good. 84. Okay, so I have a couple people that are going to age up soon. Because I do need... Honestly, I don't even know what to do now. <laughs> I do not even know what to do now. But I, I do think that I probably need to get more children. So, I'll upgrade this and I'll probably up. I'll probably add a new house. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna add a house in because I do think I need just a little bit more um, children. I don't real I don't want many more. Because we don't necessarily want to go over the school capacity. But I do think that we need just a few more. I think we need more people to come into the labor force. So if we get some more people, they will eventually happen. Because we used to rely on that, on immigrants to like boost our population. That is not really a feasible thing anymore because they hardly ever show up now. Oh, 
Oh, and we're out of logs. Uh, probably because of this. More or less. Although it should have ta dismantled this and used the stuff that was already there, so I'm not sure why that would be the case. Okay, Chloe graduated from school. As such, we're going to put you in here. Well, you got absorbed. Ugh. Because someone else died. I hate you all. Okay. You can come in here. Okay. See, that's what I'm saying. As soon as I get somebody out of school, somebody dies, and I don't actually get to do anything with them or get them into a new field because they're just replacing somebody that died already. And seriously, it's not like we have that many old people, but they're con the old people are constantly dying. That we have more old people die than we actually have old people. Oh, see, there are some immigrants, but that's like a while away. It's like over a year away. And our health really isn't that good right now. Somebody's injured. Uh, but our food is still good. Our water is good. So we're at least not failing in that part. I did not do more here. And I guess we're good right here. I guess maybe I don't need to try to get more stuff. I would like to get maybe another animal that provides, like, fat. Like cows or something like that. And not more poultry. Although goose feathers are good, and that will be a material later. Ugh. Okay, so I have somebody that graduated from school. What could you do? I mean, we could put you on the builder's cabin for right now. Because we do have this kind of stuff needed. Okay, this one here needs to start getting wood. Okay, autumn harvest is good. We pr After the harvest, I think we'll try to cut down some trees right around our settlement. It's felling. Let's go ahead and grab all this stuff right here. Because they should be close enough to the houses and everything that they're not going to freeze to death because they can't get warm. And they'll just get all these things that are in the middle of town. <sighs> yeah, I think school upgrade is what we're going to go for next. Just because, like, it's taking so long to get this new technology point that we need more... <laughs> Quickly done technology points. That's what we need. Okay. Why are there so many injured people? That's the reason why my health is so low. Because there are so many injured people. Let's go ahead and get all those trees. Apparently it does grab the Christmas trees that are right here. Which is kind of interesting. Okay. Oh, that's kind of funny. However, did not take the one that was inside the nursing home. Okay. But that's a good amount of trees. I think I'm going to gather some of these plants over here as well. We'll just do that many. Maybe this stuff right here. And hopefully then we can get some of the herbs and stuff. It's like, I, I don't know, I guess we just don't get soap all that often. Okay. 
Because, I mean, I have a soap maker. He's right here making soap. But I guess it goes out as fast as it com comes in. Okay, we're almost done with this house. And we're still working on this. But we don't have any more brick. Okay. So... This factory needs to make brick, but we don't have anyone to work it, actually. And then sand, I probably need to move over to clay. But I'll go ahead and take someone off here and put them in he here. And they can start making brick, because that'll upgrade that house. And that'll be good. Okay. We have a merchant ship coming up, and we will probably take in this group of people that come in right here. But it does look like it's going to be a while before that happens. Oh, it's so weird. This feels so empty right now. Even though I constantly do, like, cut the trees... Just feels very empty now that I've done that right here. It's kind of weird. Okay. Well, they should be able to get those done pretty quickly. And then we just have some more stuff to gather. We're still not there yet. We're still not there, and I don't know how soon that will actually get there, if it'll be by the end of this episode or not. But yeah, I think our best bet is to go for one of the research boosting things, like the school or the paper mill. I thought I understood how this worked. I'm not sure that I do. Okay. But it will, it will boost this, so it, what it doesn't tell me is what this is. Let me look, actually. Education. School. Where's the actual school part? Or is that just automatically there? Okay, I don't. School. No, it doesn't tell me, so I don't really know. We'll just... I guess we can do that and see how it goes. Because we don't have anyone to work in a paper mill anyway. So that's not going to be helpful to have a building that we can't use. So we'll do that school expansion with that next point. Then we will get back to the agriculture thing. Uh, I just want these technology points to come in more quickly than they do. Um, yeah. All right. Well, I guess that's all we're going to do for today. Um, in the next episode, hopefully we have some things happen. It does look like there's a merchant ship and some immigrants. We should get that technology point. So hopefully we will actually have things happen. Um, but uh, for now, I'm going to go ahead and end here. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!